Intriguing Walker Coonhound, 10 Facts You Won't Believe If you are looking for strong hunting dogs that can double down as lovely family dogs, then Treeing Walker Coonhounds are the perfect dog for you. These dogs were bred first in the 1800s when a tan and black dog named Tennessee Lead of unknown breed origin was crossed with the Walker Hound. Now, you might wonder why this dog has such a long and weird name. This can be traced to the history of this dog. The treeing part of the name comes from these being treeing dogs, meaning that they chased game up into trees. The walker part comes from their walker hound parent. Last but not least, coonhounds are dogs that are known to track prey through their acute sense of smell and scent. This breed of dog had officially been recognized by the United Kennel Club, UKC, in 1905, while membership from the American Kennel Club was confirmed in 2012. So, watch on for more information regarding treeing walker coonhounds. If you are looking for more dog facts, take a look at the mini Labradoodle and the French Brittany. Treeing Walker Coonhound Interesting Facts 1. What type of animal is a treeing walker coonhound? The treeing walker coonhound is a medium to large dog that belongs to the breed of hounds. These are hunting dogs that are generally suitable for life outdoors. This dog has often been referred to as the people's choice within the hound group. These dogs are known for their high energy levels and friendliness. They were recognized by the American Kennel Club, AKC, as part of the hound group of dogs in 2012 and were the last amongst the coonhounds to gain this recognition from the AKC. 2. What class of animal does a treeing walker coonhound belong to? The treeing walker coonhound is a hound dog that belongs to the class of mammalia or mammals. Like all dog breeds, the scientific name of the treeing walker coonhound is Canis lupus familiaris in the genus of Canis. 3. How many treeing walker coonhounds are there in the world? Like most dog breeds, the actual population of the treeing walker coonhound cannot be estimated. While this dog breed is not a very rare breed, the popularity of these dogs isn't off the chart as well. However, they are popular amongst hunters as a pet due to their high energy and their love for the outdoors. The American Kennel Club, AKC, ranks the treeing walker coonhound as their 137th most popular dog breed amongst 197 total dog breeds. 4. Where does a treeing walker coonhound live? Despite being part of the hound group of dogs, treeing walker coonhounds are not found in the wild. This is true for all dogs that are not bred through breeders. They are hardly ever seen as stray dogs. This breed of dogs is bred by specialized breeders. This is because the treeing walker coonhound is a purebred dog breed. Once sold by the breeder, the treeing walker coonhound lives in the house of the owner with their family. However, we will not recommend this dog breed for life in an apartment. Owing to its energy and exercise needs, the treeing walker coonhound is often restricted by life inside an apartment. It is much more suitable for a farm or country life. In urban areas, if you are indeed keeping the treeing walker coonhound, you must have a house with a long yard where they can play and exercise. 5. What is a treeing walker coonhound's habitat? As we mentioned before, this dog breed is best known for its prowess in hunting. Yet, they have not earned the popular moniker of people's choice amongst the hound breeds just because of their hunting skills. These dogs, like their parent breed, the English foxhound, are very friendly and sociable dogs. They are eager to please and their trainability is very high. Being treeing dogs, they almost always want to be outdoors. They are known to run and bark after prey and chase them up trees so that their owners or hunters can arrive to shoot the game. However, they are always in need of exercise and may grow unhappy or stressed when there is no exercise. This may adversely affect the health of the dog. This dog breed is also known for its endurance and stamina. Due to these abilities, they make for great hiking partners. They are also always ready to go on a run, so be prepared for daily training and running if you are buying this dog. The treeing walker coonhound's energy level is off the charts. However, since this one of the breeds with a higher prey drive, you should always put a leash on your treeing walker coonhound. 6. Who do treeing walker coonhounds live with? Like all domesticated dog breeds, treeing walker coonhounds do not live in packs. They are always found either with a breeder or in the house of their owner. Leaving them alone could be a bad idea as these dogs are highly sensitive and might develop separation anxiety. This may lead to the dog being violent and destructive and this, in turn, will hinder their health. On a positive note, this dog breed's friendliness and even-tempered nature make them easy to exist with other dogs in the house. Despite their hunting habits, they may become compatible with smaller pets like cats with the proper training and grooming. However, we would recommend not keeping smaller pets like hamsters with treeing walker coonhounds. 
This breed of dog is also known to get along very well with children. 7. How long does a treeing walker coonhound live? Genetically blessed with good health, this black, brown, and white-colored dog can lead a long life. Like their parent dog breed of the English foxhound, these dogs almost always live past the age of 10 years. The average age of the treeing walker coonhound dog breed has been observed to be around 12 to 13 years. However, health problems like hip dysplasia can affect the longevity of this purebred dog. 8. How do they reproduce? Not much first-hand information is available regarding the breeding and mating process of these hound dogs. However, it can be safe to say that these dogs do not really have any problems when it comes to giving birth. Like most breeds of dogs, a puppy of this dog breed can be assumed to reach their sexual maturity between the ages of 6 and 12 months. However, this may vary even within a breed group due to differences in height, weight, and development. Dogs usually reproduce through a process called the copulatory tie. Female dogs come into heat twice a year for a period of 2-3 to three weeks and the same can be said about the treeing walker coonhound. However, we can confirm that the litter size varies between 4 and 6 treeing walker coonhound puppies. Proper care must be taken of the puppies. Early socialization can play an important part in the training of this puppy. 9. What is their conservation status? The conservation status of this dog has not yet been evaluated by any of the major organizations like the International Union for Conservation of Nature, IUCN. Although these dogs have been around since the 1940s, they were only registered with the American Kennel Club in 2012. This has led to a shortage of data on the popularity of the dog through the years based on the registrations of the AKC. It must be noted that the treeing walker coonhound was found to be the 137th most popular dog out of 197 registered breeds of dogs. 10. What do treeing walker coonhounds look like? Treeing walker coonhounds are known for their distinct physical appearance. Some have also noted that this friendly pet dog is can be easily be passed on as the bigger version of the beetle breed with its long, droopy ears and the tricolored coat of black, white, and brown. They are also very similar in appearance to their parent breed of English and American foxhounds with similarities in size and fur coat. As per breeding standards, treeing walker coonhounds are known to have a broad skull. This dog breed has a muzzle that is long and square in shape. Along with these, the most distinct feature that the treeing walker coonhound has is its ears. Their long, floppy ears are very similar to those of the beetle and the foxhounds. These ears are sometimes even long enough to touch their muzzle or nose. Their eyes are well placed on their head and they have a very gentle and pleading expression in them. The color of the eyes is known to range between black and brown. However, a treeing walker coonhound dog having yellow eyes or other eyes is not thought to be part of the breed standard. The overall build of the dog is muscular with typical strong hound hind legs that are very useful while running. The treeing walker coonhound coat is another important aspect. These dogs have been observed to have a smooth coat that does not require a lot of grooming. The fur is straight and medium dense in nature. With regards to the coat color, the treeing walker coonhound comes into a combination of bicolor and tricolor. The tricolor is a combination of black, tan, and white while the bicolor is can be a combination of black and white or brown or white. If you like the video then make sure to hit that like button. Also if you want more dog training, guides, information then make sure to subscribe to our channel. Let me know what you think of this video in the comments and thank you for watching.